Hi, welcome to this edition of, of Chief Chat. Uh, you can kind of feel it. I can feel it. There's a, a palpable sense of, of excitement in the air, and that's because we're starting to be able to get out and get out with our community again uh, as restrictions start to, to lessen a little bit. Uh, the next opportunity we'll have is our bike ride, which is this Sunday the 16th at uh, 10 o'clock, and it's right out here right behind our station. And uh, we're going to meet up. We're going to ride the trails a little bit, come back, uh, have a cookout. Again, nice family, fun, uh, leisurely bike ride. So please, if you get a chance, come out and join us. We look forward to seeing you there. Uh, the next opportunity would be our torch run on June 9th. And you may be asking, what is a torch run? Well, the second week of June will be the Special Olympics Summer Games. So in order to prep for the, the Summer Games and to bring awareness, we will be carrying the, the Flame of Hope from Bal uh, Baltimore. Jeez, not from Baltimore. I'm not running from Baltimore to Bowie. Bowie Plaza to Marketplace uh, at the Chick-fil-A. And uh, it's a very, you know, fairly short group run. Group run being the operative word there where we will all be staying together at a, a nice, uh, sane pace. Uh, so if you, if you want to come out and join us, there'll be information coming uh, shortly on how to do that. Uh, the, it will be registration at 9 in the morning, the run at 10. We should be clear by by 12 at the latest. So please come out and join us. Uh, we've also been getting some uh, inquiries about when our RAD classes are going to be starting up again. For those of you who don't know, RAD is our women's self-defense class that we teach free of charge. Uh, we have been looking at that, but unfortunately with COVID restrictions still in place, we're going to have to wait a while longer until we can safely put on a class. So as soon as we know, you will know, but we, we do want to teach it as much as you guys want to take it. So as soon as we get that figured out, we'll be letting you know. Uh, Deputy Chief Preston and I will be at the Stop the Hate rally on May 23rd over at Allen Pond at, at 3 o'clock. Uh, we are uh, a couple of the speakers that are going to be featured that day. And the topic is going to be, again, Stop the Hate. And, and we're going to be focusing on some of the crimes we've seen nationally, not necessarily locally, but nationally we've seen some, some crimes against Asian American uh, citizens. And so we'll be talking about that, and it's just one of the long, uh, long list of conversations we've had regarding race, race, racism, and policing. And uh, speaking of policing, this is National uh, Police Week, and it's where we take a moment to recognize the sacrifices of the men and women who have uh, given their lives in the service of others and in the service of protecting others. So I know there's a lot of, of conversations around policing and there's a lot of different views on policing at the moment, but I think the one thing that we can all agree on is uh, that these men and women are heroes and they need to be recognized as such. So please take that half, half second during the day, a minute, and, and just think about the, the families that they left behind. So again, I hope to see you uh, Sunday out here, right out here on, uh, on the 16th at 10 o'clock for our bike ride. And if I don't, I hope I see you floating around here someplace. But stay happy, stay healthy, and we will see you next time.